My name is Germain Terrio. I'm from Bay de Lord, and I have been coming to CIS since 2001 when I was diagnosed with AFib. I've been on Coumadin, or actually I've been on Warfarin the, uh, the, since 2001, which is Coumadin. And uh, I've been on the pilot the program, the testing at home, since uh, well over five years ago. I definitely do, yes. Yes, I do recommend this for other people. The convenience, the convenience of not having to bother uh, my family to bring me to the, uh, to the clinic. Well, I think it's, it's, especially right now with COVID, it's not going into a clinic. Sometimes you don't feel really comfortable doing that. And I test every two weeks. So that would be every two weeks I would have to be going into a clinic. And uh, plus, like I said, it's not having to get up and get dressed to find somebody to bring you uh, or even drive yourself. You know, it's uh, just not having to get out. You just do it at home in the comfort of your own home. You know, what's good about that too is the knowledge that I can do something like that. You know, it really helps. Uh, it's not as hard as people would think. At first I was a little nervous, but it's it's not hard at all. You know, and the, the people who run the pilot, the, the uh, home, home monitoring, are very nice. They uh, walk you through it if you need it, and, and then eventually you realize you can do it on your own. I would say try it. Why not try it? It's, um, you'll find out that you can do it. And like I said, the people help you. Well, it, it's uh, really similar to what you do here at CIS. If you come, however many times you come, it's very similar. So you, you, uh, you clean your hands, you wash your hands very, very carefully. Uh, you get everything set up your, your little wherever station, wherever you're gonna do your test, and uh, you prick your finger, and you get a nice drop of blood, and put it on the little uh, strip that's in the meter already, and then uh, it, it tells you if it takes it. Now if you, sometimes, sometimes if I don't get enough blood, it'll, it'll reject it, which is, you just pull the strip out, put a new one in, and, and retest. And, uh, and, the, and then it tells you what your, uh, your PTI and R is. Well, I think that uh, the only thing I'd like to share is, is just to, to re-emphasize that it's, it's not hard. It, it, you might be a little nervous at first, but the people will help you through it. And, and like I said, the convenience of just being able to do it at home and in the comfort of your own home is just wonderful. You know, something you have to do if you're on Coumadin. You have to check. And then uh, they, when you call in your, your results, uh, if your result is not bad, if it's out of your range, the, uh, the people call CIS and CIS calls and gives you uh, uh, recommendations of what to do, you know, how, how to go about it, either take more medicine or less medicine or eat something else or do something, you know, they, they let you know. Uh, but they're wonderful. I have oh, I have no complaints about CIS. I love my doctor. My doctor's Dr. Ladd. And uh, I've also had a, a stent put in my heart by Dr. Fail. They're all really great, great people. The doctors, the nurses, everyone. Mm -hmm.